right yeah right there i get that that's what that is good and see i i'm i'm all for that jt that's my position right um how do you you know how do you get uh people who like manga to write get into comics problem has been like for me has been like people like who are doing comics they will they want to force a thing as to like this is manga this is comics so my thing is like hey it's sequential art don't try to bring it put a divide between between them but try to bring them both together and and the whole thing is like if you try to say manga is in comics then what you're going to do is people go well then i don't need to read that <laughs> right or if you go comics is in manga then go i don't need to read that for me who loves comics so, uh, should i say sequential art from a childhood right seven or eight to uh, freaking reading um what you call it was it like disney's goofy duck comics i uh, not goofy duck the goofy duck no Goof, the duck. goofy's a dog right donald yeah, duck yeah, yeah. Daffy. yeah donald duck. way back in fiji where i didn't even know what a comic book was nobody told me this is a comic but they just went oh look and i went oh pretty pictures you know and then come to new zealand it's like tintin oh look pretty pictures and then and then like across the road my neighbors got like freaking judge dread comics 2080 oh look pretty pictures with actually hardcore stories cool you know and so i think if we if we try to keep dividing manga from comics and i understand it's a wet you know when you look at manga uh manga it's a uh, it's an Asian Japanese art form, like which, like you know, if you if you start saying well, manhwa is not manga, people won't won't you know won't be on your side. So they go, well, it's comic books, right? So they go manhwa, manga, manhua, Chinese, right? Manhwa, Korean, you know, and manga Japanese. They go, yeah, it's the same thing. And but then if we go like, well, American comics isn't the same as European comics from Belgium like Tintin, then you go, well, why should we read American comics? So I'm, I'm all for like, I'm all for like bringing it all together. And like I said, you know, I showed you the, what we're bringing out, you know, without, without comics, it goes from manga to, uh, to uh, kind of animation looking to full on, we're not got, not haven't got to there, but we're getting to there, you know, uh, horror. So I, I love, I, I love the idea of bringing people to, together. Right. That's been because of that's why I put on like conventions. Right. That's why I opened a shop so that people from all different things, um, of love for comics and pop culture could gather together and talk. And they could be like someone who likes manga can pick up a comic book, you know, Batman or the other way around. And I think people who promote the like the negative stereotypes are like manga is in comics and comics is in manga or whatever. It's it, it's kind of like it's harmful to the comic scene not harmful for for manga because manga is freaking growing big time right and it's never going to stop um because it's it, there's more of it and it's so easily accessible digital like there's thousands and thousands like i wouldn't say thousands but there's hundreds of sites online that you can get access to them right not only that uh they man, they basically police you know what gets put out it's, uh, in the sense of like people stealing it and just putting up online and whatever but also they it's they appreciate it as an art form which western audiences are like people haven't really done for decades right they don't see it as art i mean for me right for me this is just a, just as important a piece of work as an art form and i'll read your comment in a minute sorry um after I get off my tirade, <laughs> right? It's just as good as representatives of a you know top notch art as anybody who's painting a friggin' oil painting by some concerned. If not that, more so because there's so much more work goes into it, because there's more characters on the scene, there's more depth to it than just some friggin' oil painting. And by the way, I have painted oils, right? And and I mean like a dozen of them and giving them away. And I've done acrylic paintings and I'm a painter as well right but i appreciate comics because there's so much more work goes into it and i hate the fact that people don't understand how good it is out there 
Like none of this friggin' thing, like right? None of this would exist without some somebody. Is it Shiori? Uh, Shiro, right? No, this, I'm, I was thinking with the other person, Mamori Oshis, right? Mamori Oshi, yeah. Yeah. So who's the, who's Shiro, the creator of? Uh, uh, is it the man, uh, Masamune Shiro? I think it's the manga artist. Yeah. Yeah. So you know, without that, we wouldn't have that, and without that, we wouldn't have somebody in the movie, right? And this is the this is why I get really pissed off at people, and I, I'm not too much you, JD. Uh, like in general, like common newbies who think like, oh, it belongs to kids. You know, comics are for kids, and that's why for me, I'm like, I grew up at like about eight or nine years old reading 2000 AD. Right, it's not something supposed to be read by 2000 you know kids my my age at that time. But so was my neighbor was his parents were giving him that, and he was buying it for himself. And so we're reading about war in space, you know, uh, mutations and stuff. 